Coburn Bible, Book 6, Book of Morals and Precepts, Chapter 34, Truth. Much of the book is to develop your moral code. Avoid using it to judge others. NPR 3412. Truth cannot be determined by the arguments of men. It is therefore not to be weighed according to their arguments, but their arguments according to the light of truth, as it is revealed and known. Say not that truth is established by time, or that a multitude of believers make certainty. NPR 3413 The best truth men can ever have to judge is truth parent, for truth in actuality cannot be manifested to men on earth. Then with regard to truth and falsehood, do they not appear alike in things beyond our understanding? How then could we decide between them? or not for the whispers of our conscience. NPR 3415 Seek after truth, for it is the greatest of things man can understand. God is beyond his comprehension, but truth is not. It alone is the path towards the fulfillment of the destiny of man. Progress through life is the unveiling of truth, but can man ever stand in her august presence? As the owl is blinded in the splendor of the sun, so will man be dazzled before the unveiled face of majestic truth. NPR 3416 Truth is oft times veiled with deceit or tainted with the foul touch of hypocrisy. Truth without honesty is a tree without leaves. A distorted truth has a visage more frightening than any other conceivable horror and even the innocent heart quails before it. NPR 3417 O oh, majestic truth, what wickedness is wrought in your fair name? What pain you suffer at the mouths of hypocrites and deceivers, where so often a fragment of truth is built into the fabric of a great falsehood? Words are worthless. It's actions that will decide if they have value and how much value is placed on it. The light of truth, I suggest, is learning to listen, but also judge the words with the actions of the person speaking to decide if they live the words they speak. The comment at the end seems to contradict what I just said, however. I don't think it does. Just because words over time are repeated and accepted by many as gospel does not mean it is true. For example, this book sometimes has truth that is based on the times they live in. Yet as time passes, a new truth is discovered. Only time and experience will decide if it is the truth or just a ledge on the path to truth. Do not become so rigid and threatened by uncertainty, it will make others embracing their free will a threat to you. Out of fear and knowledge that we have an expiration date, you might ruthlessly put society in a straitjacket that only a few can thrive in. God gave a gift and you're demanding, many give it up to make you feel secure that you have solved the riddle that will see God at the finish line with a pat on the head and a reward. You say to yourself you are doing what you know to be wrong for their own good, but it's just to protect you from uncertainty.